What's going on guys? This is Taylor from the Southwest Wheel Warehouse. Today we're going to be looking at the BK550HYD. This is going to be our hydraulic brake kit for a 3500 pound axle with a 5 on 5 bolt circle. If you look right here, this is the box you get it in. It's got our nice logo on it. Down in here we got two smaller boxes that will hold everything in place while it comes to you. Make sure nothing gets there broken. We got our two smaller boxes. You can see right here. We got our true rod hub and drum with our half inch zinc coated studs and the way we measure these is from stud to closest stud and that measurement is going to be three inches center to center. We can see we got our races pressed in on both sides already and we have our backing plate and right here this is our true ride hydraulic backing plate. It's got our hydraulic piston right here and the way we tell left hand and right hand with these is we see this little part right here that's going to be facing your truck. So we'll come over here, pull out our small parts and our other hub and drum. We can see in this kit we're going to get two hub and drums, a left hand and a right hand backing plate. And we're going to get two castle nuts and two cotter pins. A lot of guys want to send you the cotter pins. We like to make sure that no matter what you're doing with these, you have them for every application. You'll throw your castle nut on your spindle, your cotter pin will go right through like that, hold it on there nice and deep, nice and deep. And we have our mounting hardware. So we're going to get eight studs, eight nuts, and eight washers. So these are just going to pop in right there. They're going to pop through the plate on the axle, throw your washer on, throw your nut on, You're good to go. Then we're going to have our bearings, we're going to get an inner and outer for each side. You can see the big one's going to be our inner, and that's an L68149. And our small one's going to be our outer, and that's going to be an L44649. Our outers are just going to pop in right there, and our inners are just going to pop in right there. Then we have our seals. We're going to get two seals. And what we're going to do with these is you'll pop your inner bearings in and then you'll pop your seal on like that just behind it. We're going to get 10 lug nuts. And we're going to get 4 grease caps. Now the reason you get 4 grease caps is we're going to get 2 with this hole in it and 2 solid. The 2 with the hole in it are for the easy loose spindle. And these are going to come with your tang washer like this. This is going to replace the cotter pin. They will also come with this rubber piece and you can see right here it's already installed in this one. And then these are our solid grease caps for our regular spindle and they will come with our regular washers. And these grease caps just pop right on here on the top. They just pop right in. Thanks for watching guys. It's just that simple. That was the BK550HYD.